Hey guys, so this is going to be a Dollar Tree haul. I still have more Dollar Tree hauls to upload and film for you guys. After I film this Dollar Tree haul, I'm probably going to have to stop, upload them, wait, delete them, and then start again because my camera runs out of memory. I apologize for that, but they will be up. I also have my 99 cent only store haul to film, so we'll go ahead and get started. So the first thing that I'm going to show you guys are these Apodex SX7, let's see, these are cutting edge appetite control. It's like a powder and it says helps control appetite for hours with kelp fiber, also contains spinach extract with, I cannot pronounce this, thylakoids, great tasting non-stimulant formula, mixed berry smoothie. So... This is a dietary supplement. You can make it in a smoothie. You can put it in a drink. Mainly people make smoothies with these. It says it's a new and improved new and improved for easier mixing. It's 21 servings and it, it contains epithel. I've never tried this. I don't know how well it works. I don't even know that I'll use this, but in case someone wants it or I decide to use it, I kind of want to research it online. I thought these looked like really nice containers for a dollar. I know that sounds kind of dumb, like, oh, the containers looked nice, but let's face it, I need to lose weight, so I'm going to do some research on these. They had about five or six of these left at the Dollar Tree I was at, and one of them was open, plus I gave one to another lady. I had to bend down and look on the bottom shelf way in the back for more of them, and I originally put all of them in my cart except for the opened one and then the one that I gave the lady but I thought you know what I need to research these before I just go out and buy a bunch of them plus it's 21 servings so that's 42 servings then I got this which they seem to have a lot of as well and this says America's number one fastest growing but like I said they slap that on to so many different things it says purely inspired Appleus Appetite Control, and it says helps keep hunger away for hours with added kelp fiber. So both of these products that I just showed you have kelp fiber in them. Great tasting natural flavor. It's a dietary supplement. It's gluten-free, non-GMO. It's vegan, good source of fiber. It's got the healthy spinach extract with, well, I already read that. It's This one's the Berry Fusion Smoothie, and this is also a 21-day supply. This one I originally also had two of, but I put it back and just got one because I still have to research this one. This one you can just put into a water bottle. You don't have to make a smoothie, which you can do with the other one as well, but I'm guessing it probably wouldn't taste as good. So I got that. I picked up one can of the Libby's Whole Kernel Sweet Corn. This is 15 ounces of corn. No complaints about that corn. I picked up another Tapatio hot sauce. This is 10 fluid ounces. We just ran out. This is something we always keep in the house to put in top ramen, put on tacos, whatever. I don't know, whatever we want to use it for. I got two boxes of the rice roni chicken flavor. It's the 6.9 ounce box. This is something that I've bought for a long time. I also like the Spanish rice. That's pretty much a favorite of mine. I got these sweethearts, and I thought these were really cute because they have the cute words on them. So I got three of them. I want to say they had about five different words, sayings, whatever on them. I got Glam, Diva, and then Wild Child, which I really liked. I thought those would be really cute for friend Mel. And this is the Real Sweethearts brand. And these ones say Dazzled Hearts, and these are the Sweet and Sour. I got one of these, actually two of these Russell Stover marshmallow hearts covered in milk chocolate. I got one for Jordan and one for Robert. I think Russell Stover is a good brand of chocolate. It actually tastes like chocolate. Doesn't taste like what I like to say, mocklet. If you guys have ever seen that episode of Friends where 
Monica has to make the fake chocolate. That's what I call the nasty tasting off-brand chocolate. I call it Mocklet. So there's the two of those. And they've had a lot of the really nice Russell Stover king size candies. They've had cake batter, marshmallow, what is it, the candied apple or what the heck is caramel apple. Just so many different good ones. I've been on a sunflower seed kick. Instead of eating, I just eat sunflower seeds. It kind of, like, tides me over. So I love the nacho cheese and ranch. And they surprisingly had a lot of the ranch ones there. So I picked up three bags of the Jumbo David sunflower seeds. These are four ounces each. The third one must be in another bag. I picked up a uh, black pepper. It's the Spice Time brand, and it is 1.5 ounces. We ran all the way out of regular pepper. I know the stuff I'm showing you guys is kind of boring, but I do have a lot of good stuff. I picked up a pack of the Wrigley's Winter Fresh Gum. You uh, buy four and save. Let's see... I got this NYC nail polish, and this one, I don't know if I can see a name on this. This is the 215 Late Night Latte. So this is kind of a latte color. It's got a pearl look to it. I thought it was really pretty, so I got that one. I got a couple of the NYC nail polishes. This is by Muscle Tech as well. This is Concentrated Series NeuroCore Super Concentrated Pre-Workout Stimulant. It says Energy, Focus, Muscle Pump, Strength, and it's got six super concentrated doses. It's Fruit Punch. I actually got this for Jordan because he's been working out, but he says that he doesn't know if he'll take it because he doesn't know if it's going to make his heart race or anything like that. So I don't know. I'll probably give it away to someone. I saw these hand soaps, and these were new, at least to me. I don't think I've seen them on anyone's videos, and that's not to say that they're not on people's videos, because I guarantee you they are. I just haven't seen them. And I was just going to get all pink, but I decided to give each different scent a try, so I got the blue one. I thought these looked really nice. This says hand soap, and this one's fresh mint and freesia scented. They're each 10 ounces, and I like how it's got the flowers on the back, so it kind of, you know, goes through to the front. I got the blackberry and pink peony, and then I got the lemon and lime. This one is my favorite, the pink one, and I thought especially for Valentine's Day, these would look pretty out around the house but like I said I wanted to give them all a shot so I got them all I'll let you guys know what I think of those hand soaps and of course wouldn't you know that the lady put this bow look at this bow you guys I made sure that I picked out the nicest looking bow I could find she put those hand soaps on top of this bow this is going back and I I'm going to exchange it, and I really hope that my local Dollar Tree has these same bows. This is just unacceptable. Who would put a bow under these heavy hand soaps? It makes no sense to my brain. So there's no way I'm putting this bow on a package, and there's no way that I can fix it. It's just done. So I'm going to have to exchange this, but when it was still intact, it was really, really cute. It's got this really shimmery kind of glittery look to it and it's got the leopard they had it in zebra stripes I took pictures of the different ones this is in the viola brand so I will show you guys the new one once I get it it didn't look this shabby I promise I got two of these let me see they are the anti-frizz serums it says Frizz Control Serum, and this is in the Curl Care brand. And the Dollar Tree in Modesto, because I went to two of the Dollar Trees in Modesto, the one on Oakdale Road has a lot of the Urban Care stuff. 
or urban hair care stuff and they have a lot of the curl care product as well so i took pictures of all of the it's a line called urban i took lots of pictures of that hair care stuff and then a lot of pictures of the curl care brand so i got two of these frizz control serums it says with vitamins fights tough humidity and frizz helps hold curls for up to 12 hours and it's four fluid ounces. It also came with a little weightless moisturizing cream with coconut and vitamin E to nourish and soften. It says, unique natural complex with honey and vitamins helps hold curls for up to 12 hours. This is sulfate and paraben free and it's 0.25 ounces in this little pack. So I thought this looked like a nice product and I love like any type of frizz hair serum I use the bio silk and sometimes I do like to do my hair curly so I will use this when I do and this one I think you can probably use even when you're not having curly hair because it just says it's a frizz control thing I got two of these sunglass clip holders I got one for Jordan on his side the passenger side I got him black and then I got me, if I can find it in here, I got me pink. And if my camera just cuts off, you guys, which it probably will, just go on to the next Dollar Tree haul because it'll just probably run out of memory. So we're always putting our glasses, like, in the center console or in the glove box, just in random spots. And I thought with these, we could keep our sunglasses on the clips of the visors I have tons of different ones but I have like a pair that I'll be into for that week or that month and Jordan usually has like one pair he has a couple but he has one nice pair that he'll wear for the whole year so they had multiple colors in these and these were the colors that I liked best I picked up one pack of these elf nail polish remover pads it's in the fresh citrus scent you get 24 of them I've never used these but I thought for a dollar I'd give them a try here's another one of the NYC nail polishes and this one looks very similar to this one but this one's kind of more of a mocha latte color and this one's got a hint of the kind of pink cotton candy in it so, like I said, this one is the 215 Late Night Latte, and then this one is the 175 Lingering, is that Lingering Lingerie? I don't know if that's Lingering Lingerie or what it says, but that's what it looks like. I could be wrong. I think I got three of those nail polishes, three or four. Here's the second frizz control serum I might give this away in the giveaway for the second or third place winner obviously not just this by itself but I might include this since I did get two of them because I think it's nice I got this journal or this it's actually a two pack of journals and I definitely don't need journals but I love this pink one it says the best way to get something done is to begin and then the one on the back says future belongs to those who believe in the dream so I'll probably include this purple one in the giveaway and keep the pink one I got these cute butterfly stickers it's in the jot brand you get eight I got these butterflies with all the rhinestones. I just thought those were really cute. They had multiple colors in these butterfly rhinestones. They had red, pink, blue. I got the little crowns, which were my favorite because I love crowns. You also get eight, and they had these in multiple colors as well, which I did get multiple colors in the crowns. <clears throat> And I'll show those to you when I get to them. I got this NYC nail polish. And this is a really pretty kind of cotton candy glitter. And I cannot see the name of this at all, you guys. So if you're interested to, the, sorry, to know the name, I'm getting tongue twisted, 
Let me know in the comments and I will open it and let you know what the name of that is. Here is another NYC nail polish and I thought this color was super pretty. This is kind of very similar, almost identical to the color that's on my nails. It's kind of a purple magenta color and it's got a very subtle hint of shimmer in there if you can see that. I either got four or five of these. I thought it was three, but now that I think back, I did get quite a few. So these look almost the same, but like I said, this has a pink cotton candy. This is latte, sheer kind of glitter, and then the color that's on my nails. This would be really pretty over this color. So I think that's all of the NYC nail polishes that I got. These nail polishes looked like they would be nice to me. I got this pack of WWE stickers. I'm actually going to put these in one of Robert's birthday presents. I think he has a pack of the WWE stickers. And he's not too into stickers, but I could not pass up this pack of WWE because he loves it. So it's got all the different pages of all the different wrestlers. The Undertaker, Stone Cold, just... All the different ones. So it's got, like I said, 200 plus stickers, which I thought was a good deal. They have WWE lighters at the Dollar Tree, but obviously I'm not going to buy Robert a lighter. But just in case you're older and you're into WWE, just know that they have lots of the different lighters. So here's another pack of the crowns, and it's the pink rhinestone ones. So here's the regular color ones next to it and the butterflies. I just thought these were super pretty. I know for a fact the second and third place winner of the giveaway is going to be included some of the stickers because I have so many. None of the ones that I've received in any of my friend mails, but ones that I've purchased. Then I've showed something similar to you guys in these. I bought a couple, but it wasn't... Well, actually, it might have been a cell phone case, but it was a lot smaller. This is a much bigger one. I still don't think my phone will fit in this because my phone is really big. It might fit without the case, but with the case, I don't think so. I just thought this looked nice. It says fits most smartphones. It's got the magnetic closure, so when you open it, it's got the little snap and it's magnetic, and then it's also got the clip on the back. If my phone does happen to fit in this, I thought putting this on my visor in my car and then putting my phone in there would be nice. If not, I'll give it to Jordan. They had the brown, which is what I chose, and then they had black. I know it looks black on camera, but it's actually brown. And then I think I actually did pick up a pack of these as well, but I thought these were a good deal. You get pink, purple, and blue. And when I write on the dry erase boards to you guys and I show them on camera, I would like to be able to have cute colors like pink, purple, and stuff like that. So this is the Pro Marks brand, which is a good brand. And they had one more pack of three other assorted colors. I can't remember exactly what the colors were, but they weren't the same. I meant to open this before I showed it to you guys. This is a pack of three little journals. One the zebra one right there, which I thought was a pretty cool design, has the ruled pages. Then there's that one with the little chihuahua. That's got the grid pages. And then this one on the back with the little kitty, which I know it's kind of weird, but I still thought it was cute, has just the blank pages. So I'll probably include one of these in the giveaway. And... I'm going to go ahead and end the video here, and I still have a couple more Dollar Tree hauls for you guys, so I hope you guys will go over and watch them because I have lots of goodies to show you guys, and yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.